Welcome to Coco Sports. I am the huge one, a kid idiot, Dave Coco from DaveCocio.com. We are on, we are Coco Sports on Twitch, Twitter, TikTok, Instagram, MySpace, Facebook, and the mean streets of Yokohama. Hey, what's going on, everyone? I just want to talk about Yuka Sakasaki has decided to graduate from TJPW. I'll put a link. They are on YouTube in Japanese. I'd like to thank Rick1982 for sending me the link. And I'd like to thank Bear Friend, my wife. Bear Friend, thank you. <laughs> she did She did some translations because my Japanese is h horrible, even though I've lived here 500 years in a row. Yeah. Anyway. Yuka Sasaki will continue her pro wrestling careers overseas from 2024. Um, she will still have some matches here. She's going to... Uh, let me just read the translations and I'll give my opinion. Yuka uh, Sakasaki will continue her pro wrestling careers overseas from 2024. She'll be abroad from May 14th to June... Uh, May 13th to June 4th, so her matches in the TJP uh, W will not happen during that time. Uh, her next match in Japan will be Princess Tag Tournament on June 11th in Cork and Hall. I might have to go to that, boys. I might have to go to that with uh, Mizuki against uh, Tatsumi and uh, Watatana. A little, I'm stuttering. I'm stuttering here. Watanabe. Uh, Watanabe is actually pretty amazing. I gotta go see that match live. I, I gotta, I'm gonna start buying more and more tickets to go to live events. <laughs> I'm kind of excited. I think I think reviews can only go so far. I think I just, you know, I'm retired. I have time. And yeah, I'm going to go check out more events. Uh, Yuko will graduate TJPW on December 1st in Corican Hall. All right, so definitely have to try to get tickets for that. This date uh, is very important to her. Uh, she made her debut 10 years ago on that date. So that factor helped her made up her mind as well. Uh, she went on saying, it was uh, difficult for me to make this decision, but since I have been in TJPD be exactly 10 years, I thought it was a good timing. I knew I had to graduate sometime, but TJPW is so special to me. These 10 years I spent fighting was like a flash. It would be so quick if I didn't decide on this timing. I would have stayed here forever. So, um, I wish you would. I love pro wrestling. My physical conditions are great. I still love uh, TJPW, but I have to rebrand my image somehow along my road. Mm, you don't really have to. It was not going to happen in Japan. I had to leave uh, TJPW image behind for my new chapter to come. And that's kind of sad that it's it's like that, but we'll get we'll talk more of that. Uh, would you ever return to the ring? I don't know yet, but I guess it's 100% not for TJPW. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Noah, did you have something to do with this? Yay. I like watching one women's match instead of a whole league. You keep up the good work. Good job, North Americans. Um, so there you go. Do you have, uh, let's see. So, uh, so she's never returned to TJPW. Do you have unfinished business left behind in TJPD, P TJPW? Uh, she goes on. There are things I can do only in TJPW. And I yet ha have untold stories. Within the next seven months. So we got seven months. With the time I have left, I intend to express it all and leave nothing behind. Um, she also goes on to say, I have talked about it, uh, my graduation to Mizuki for a long time, and she always supported my decision. She always had my back, and that made me want to stay at TJPW even more, and I wish you could. Uh, and then she went on to say, I want to go to Disneyland with the belts. And then she looked kind of confused as oops was i not supposed to say it out loud was that okay she, she looked at her agent and the person uh doing the interview um so i think they might have something worked out with disney um she also goes on i've been talking about uh communicating with athletes of aew i want to invite them to japan so pro wrestling fans that can't make it to america uh could see them in action and uh, uh, see them in japan um and that, that should be exciting that should be really exciting so hopefully you go and um the guy on stage said TJPW has always been a gateway. Keyword gateway for pro, uh, female pro wrestlers to step forward, to take a leap into their journeys. I'm sure TJPW will thrive even more with young and promising wrestlers that look up to senpais joining in and always have torches of pro wrestling spirit passed on. That's the kind of organization we are. So there you go. That's pretty much what went down, at least the key parts that I thought of. Um, I'm super excited. She didn't She didn't say she's going to AEW, but it, it feels that way that she, she's probably going to head over to AEW. And I'd love to see her become a star. I wish TJPW got more respect than it does, even from its owners, even from Noah. Noah. One match, huh? You giving yourself a Barry Horowitz? I uh, it's just sad because TJPW is one of the one of 
probably the greatest female wrestling organizations going today. Um, I still say their top of the roster is better than Stardom's top of the roster, but most fans don't watch TJPW, so they just think I'm crazy. <laughs> They're like, okay, whatever. Um, I wish her nothing but the best of luck. I I'm kind of sad that she's like, I'm not coming back 100%. That part kind of bothered me. And... Yeah, and I also don't like the fact that the agent or the person doing the interview, or I apologize who, who the guy was, I, I don't know. I feel kind of like TJPW and Noah don't have to be feeder leagues. Your failure as an organization is why it's a feeder league. You know, it's, and here, and there's so many fans that would rather watch one match on Noah. I'm, no, I'm sorry. Let me rephrase that. You're right, Noah. There's so many North American fans that would rather watch one match on Noah or one match on New Japan than support Stardom or TJPW. And, th and that makes me sad. I hope she has a great career in AEW. I hope she shines. And I hope um, moving forward, TJPW doesn't see themselves as a feeder league. I, I think the top five, six wrestlers in that company can hang with any other women in the world. Now, granted, do they have some young lions, young girls? Yes. Do they have students coming up? Yes. There is a lot of students. A big chunk of the card is students. Another big chunk of the card is comedy. But the top of the card is top notch. So I hope more people watch TJPW and see some uh, great women headed out. And yeah, so I'm kind of I'm kind of happy and sad. You know, we get seven more months with her. The titles are not vacant. I know Rick1982 was worried about that. The titles are not vacated. We have nine, and we get one more send off in Cork and Hall. So it's like a happy, sad moment. It's a happy, sad moment. If you do know Japanese, we'll put a link. Um, we'll put the, you know, the link down below and you can see um, the the actual press conference yourself. And yeah. Uh, I don't know. I, I, I like, I know it sounds weird because I'm just like repeating what they said, but I'm now I'm giving my opinion. I'm kind of all over the place on emotions. I'm kind of happy that she's going to get to step off into the world, hopefully have success in North America. I'm kind of happy that, you know, we have her for seven more months. I'm happy that we don't get the title stripped off them. Uh, you know, I'm happy for her. Thank you for the 10 years. Um, but I'm also sad because TJPW and Cyberfight are okay with being a feeder league for the rest of their lives. And that, that makes me sad. It's kind of it's kind of hard. It reminds me of ECW. It reminds me of Ring of Honor and its prime. It's kind of hard after year after year to get behind a product and love it and cheer for it. And they don't even see the the full potential in themselves, you know. And then I'm also kind of angry because she's like, ah, "I'm never coming back." And it's like, "Will there?" Let's be honest. Is there a TJPW to come back to? Will Stardom survive? You know, will the women's wrestling survive? I don't know. Women wrestling fans in North America would rather see one match, two matches on a men's card than a stacked fucking roster of great women so i don't know i i guess i'm all over the place on this one so what's your thoughts down below like comment subscribe tell me if you like doing more stuff like this i'll just i'll just poke my my wife be like Psh, can you translate this bear Psh, translate this and maybe we'll do it more often all right give us your thoughts and even though it hasn't been officially said or at least i don't know if it's been officially said it feels like she's going to AEW. So, all right. We are Coco Sports here. TikTok, Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, MySpace, and the mean streets of Yokohama. With that, hold on. I was going to try to do something. Oh, good. I can. With that, I am over. Ba -da -na 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 -na. Hey, ba -da bum, bum, bum. <laughs> Look, it said I'm over.